This is my 1080 tie by MSI, the Seahawk X edition. It's had a long life. Unfortunately, that life has come to an end. Anyways, these four screws are for the cooler. These exterior bordering ones on the perimeter are for the back plate. So the back plate is off. It's a nice quality one, I think so. Sounds good. Now we're gonna take the shroud off on the other side. The screws are all along the side here. They're all really tiny. Store them in a safe place. I'll be back in a minute. Shameless self-promotion here, but if you're in need of a tray to store your screws, check out my website, getslicks.com. This is like 10 bucks. Here's what the inside looks like. I actually had to break off the two clips on the ends here because the screws weren't coming out. Do not forget to take out the screws in the back. But other than that, you should be good to go. And now we're gonna undo the screws that keep the water cooler on here. Super professional with it. Everything has been removed. Don't even ask how I got this off without removing the port plate because it'll just trigger me. I should mention that I actually had to cut off the port plate and sand it down and reshape it with a hammer. So I guess you could say I'm getting pretty serious into custom fabrication. Just kidding. Anyways, check out the next video where I put the Morpheus on the PCB. Peace.